Welcoming you to York Lions Stadium, where York United are preparing to host Calgary's own Cavalry FC. The Cavs are potentially one more win away from becoming the CPL's regular season champions, but the Nine Stripes are in a playoff dogfight. They simply cannot afford to lose. Six changes by Martin Nash to the team that was beaten by Pacific 4-1 at home last week. Osase Di Rosario leads the line and a second start of the season in goal for Elias Jimenez. Tommy Wilden Jr. makes three changes to the team that beat Vancouver last time out. Charlie Trafford's recovered from injury, comes in in a defensive midfield role. Jesse Daly, the Australian, is back from suspension. That's a problem too though, Nigel. Sometimes when you do get those early, early yellow cards in the first 10 minutes or so, it kind of changes your game a little bit because you've got to be very wary how you play. You've got to calm things down. You can't be as aggressive. Towards the penalty spot and the header is flicked on. together but a fair challenge by both referee waves play on Cavs do just that Moosey trying to get in behind at full pace Moosey can be really dangerous here and just wide and Shimano did just enough to put him off or so somewhat and the Salsa de Rosario spreads it for Johnny Grant on that far side chance to open his legs Away from Camargo, back for Di Rosario, has the shots, moving the big save. And Carducci is tested, got smartly down to his right-hand side. But Di Rosario's effort was on target and heading for the corner. Yeah, it was a good strike. Very good strike from the big man. Next weekend, Halifax Wanderers against Forge, the champions, another Big battle in the Maritimes for playoff places. And one soccer, Johnny Grant. Goes to Curl, straight into the midriff of Marco Carducci. Look for the reverse pass, and Daly wasn't quite sure. In the end, order is restored, and Moosey comes forward as Richie gets to his feet in frustration. Poked forward by Schoen, and Bevan across the area. Camargo's got a score here. He has scored seven minutes before half time, and Cavalry finally find a way to go on the counter attack. Bevan for Camargo, and the Cavs lead by goal to nil. Just watching that white jersey's there attacking his base, and Cobbs up can bring it forward for Cavalry. I love seeing that with fullbacks. Fullbacks that want to get forward, take players on. Now then, Bevan trying to shut the keeper. He lost it really well to spread his body. This was the chance for Bevan a moment ago. Needed to just chip it over Himaras. Didn't quite get it right. Forward for Ricci. And Ricci. Austin Ricci into the air. Austin Ricci left for him. Uh, Cobbs did it brilliantly to get his body in the way. And then it's a coming together. It's a goal kick. Well, the initial block by Cobbs as Richie pulled the trigger. Did really well to get his body in the way. Rain it in, but Santos was too quick for him. Richie for the pace, Richie, that's interesting. And Carducci got enough on it, just enough on it. His deals are always pitching at the far post. Daniel Napare in behind perhaps. Checks his run, left footed, that's his favourite. Help John Santos. Carducci in the way. Everybody stopped momentarily thinking he might be offside. It's going to be a free kick. Santos flicked across, should have scored. Martin Paul robbed by Camargo. Has he got the legs to get there? Pursued by Samaro. Camargo doesn't have the legs, needs some help. And it's coming in the form of Maya Bevan. And Moosey is to his left, and Matt Bevan didn't see him. Camargo pulls the trigger. Helped away by Grant. Good save by Imanas. Second attempt by Dilly. 
Here was the chance at the other end, flicked on, and Johnny Grant couldn't quite get there, and Ali Moussi was back doing some heroic defending. And then, on the breakaway, Camargo at the other end came back to Sergio Camargo, forced the save from Yimaras, either set one up or perhaps score one himself. Hasn't quite rolled for him yet. But there's at least 25 minutes remaining, and Ricci... <laughs> Shown, kept it in. Finds Daly. And square. Plays red, find a fine Moosey, Ali Moosey with his left foot, took a deflection. Sometimes referees need eyes in the back of the head. Now, what can G conjure up from this free kick? That's decent. Wright was trying to get there. Paris G will deliver one more time. This has got to be the last chance for York United. It's now or never for the nine strikes. Camden, important header, they're trying to keep it going. Referee says it was offside, Johnny Grant, who wouldn't have counted. Carducci launches it long. The referee blows his final whistle. Cavalry are nine points clear, and they are on the cusp of becoming Canadian Premier League regular season champions. Sergio Camargo with the winning goal.